Okay, this is part two of the uh, flea cur uh, homemade flea circus carousel. Uh, I apparently thought I was recording and I had gotten to the point where I was going to show you the inside. So, and apparently I had stopped it. So we're going to make two parts out of this thing. So now we go inside and we can see the motor was epoxied into the um, into the uh, cigar box. All right, so the motor was epoxied in here, which is good. And I left the stem outside to hook up to the dowel, okay? And then you've got a nine volt battery with nine volt battery clips to connect to the wiring. And of course I mentioned, I think I mentioned, but I'm not sure in part one, that the two yellow wires that come out of the receiver, okay, because this is remote control, the two yellow wires that come out of the receiver go to the receiver, and then there's a red and a black wire coming out of the receiver, which goes to the 9-volt batteries. So you take the two yellow wires and hook them up to whatever you want to, okay? Uh, in this case, I hooked them up to the motor, all right? But this uh, wire here, by the way, it is yellow. Okay, good. This yellow wire should have been hooked here, and this yellow wire should have been hooked here, okay? So that I would have gotten the forward and reverse correct on the remote control. But I accidentally didn't do that, you know? It's no big deal if you push the bottom, the bottom button over there, and it just makes the carousel go forward, and the top button makes it go backwards. It's not, it's not uh, gonna destroy the effect at all. Uh, when you when you do something like that, okay. So, coming out of the uh, of the receiver, which is under here, I hot glue the receiver here along with the uh, the antenna. I just left that hang loose, but I hot glued the uh, receiver, uh, which I shrink wrapped. I put it in shrink wrap to protect it. Okay. So the two yellow wires and the two red, the red and black wire come out of the receiver. The two yellow wires, as I said, go to the motor and the red and black wire uh, go to the battery clips. But because I have an on-off switch, a toggle switch right here, what happens is the red wire comes out, goes to the toggle switch, and then goes to the red plus of the battery uh, clip that you buy, okay? And then the black wire goes directly to, from the, uh, from the receiver, right to the other battery clip, which connects to the, the negative portion of the nine volt battery. All right, this is not rocket science, people. Go upside, go, uh, go on YouTube and type in, how do I wire something with a switch and a battery? And it'll show you, trust me, it's not that difficult to do. Okay, and I use a little shrink wrap here. We got my shrink wrap there. I don't know what I was thinking, but it's not, Everything else is shrink wrapped, so I'm not too worried about creating a short. All right, so that's basically it. This is part two. Uh, the battery clips you can get on Amazon. Uh, the uh, uh, the um, uh, motors, I showed you the motors already. You can get that up on uh, Amazon too. They're from Canada. Toggle, uh, t the, the two position toggle switch again is one of those things that's going to be uh, you're going to have to get five or six or a bag of them in order to buy one, but that's not a big deal. And this is the remote control as I showed you on the uh, computer in part one. It is a dual diversity, all right? And what you're going to do is you're going to, this is the off position. It's another mistake. <laughs> this should have been the off position, but again, I must have been drinking that day. I don't drink, but I must have been drinking something. So when you hit the bottom button, let's turn it on, okay? You hit the bottom button, the carousel goes to the right. Okay, I love the fact that this is a very slow motor. Again, I use this motor for building my cigar box uh, flea circuses that people buy from me. Okay, and of course, see, this should have been forward, but it is now backwards and it'll go back. And then you've got your stop button, which stops everything. And of course, you want to turn off your switch so you don't drain your battery. And that's basically it. That is my homemade cigar, uh, cigar box carousel. Now, on last, last thing. 
uh, you can decorate these things with little jewels. You can put more stuff on there. I just chose to leave it this way, okay? It's plain. It's simple. Uh, it's like what fleas deserve, you know? They don't deserve, uh, you know, Disney World and all the fancy schmancy rides uh, at Disney World. This is this is what they deserve, you know? They do a good job when, I, when I'm performing my flea circus with my with my spectators and my audiences, and they get to ride the, the uh, police circuses. Now, some of them, some of them, uh, when they when they don't do a good job in the police circus, I have some of them going inside and pushing the motor. I don't even turn on the switch, so that the ones that did a great job are riding the the animals while. The ones that didn't do a, such a great job are actually rotating the motor by pushing it. So this is the punishment that I give my fleas. So my fleas know better. They got to do good shows when I, when I, when I do a show. That being said, all of this stuff is is um, available to you on the internet and at uh, and at uh, Amazon. And I really appreciate you watching. And if anybody's got questions. Messenger me or email me or send me a Facebook something and I will help you with whatever situation it is that you want help with in building something like this. Take care. Frank Paris over and out.